like to make to Parham? It sounds strange, even arrogant, but that book, which I wrote when I was 26 or 25 years old, which was published when I was 28, I would never make any change in that book. Not a line, not a sentence, not a comma. It just was a beginner's luck or a fluke that, I, no, I wouldn't change anything. Is there any character from mythology whose story you would like to retell? There is, and I don't know if I should say this, but the, the character who is drawing my attention these days is Radha. After Sita, Radha is the other totally enigmatic figure in uh, Hindu mythology. She is a woman of deep independence and uh, she is a consort, but she is a consort without being a wife. And yet every temple across India, it is always Radhe Shyam. I have been to um, Vrindavan and I find it draws, Vrindavan draws me again and again. So I want to, I can't say I want to write about Radha, but I want to study Radha. I want to understand Radha. Do you believe in ghosts? Absolutely. I am a good Pahari Kumauni girl. If you grow up in the mountains, you see them every day. I must say that the ghosts of Delhi are not so visible to me. But whenever I travel to the hills, uh, yeah, they speak to me. And uh, I must confess, I am not afraid of ghosts, but I am very, very interested in them and what they want to say. Which book are you reading currently? At the moment, I'm rereading a book I read many, many years ago. It's a book called Contact by Carl Sagan. It's, it's about travel in space, about contact with other forms of life, about reaching out to the inner human soul by understanding our place in the universe. And uh, it's one of the most beautiful books I've ever read. So I'm reading it again. Who is your favorite author and why? My favorite author is a writer called Muriel Spark, who sadly is no longer alive. She was very prolific. She wrote uh, over 22 books, I think. And they were all very thin, very enigmatic books. There is, uh, her most famous book is possibly The Prime of Miss Jean Brodie, but she wrote many, many, many others. And uh, what I like about her writing is that she says very little, and in that very little, she manages to say a lot. It's, it's, a, it's a great talent to say so much in so few words. Festival director or an author? Which is your favorite song? I think an author. But, uh, you know, being an author is a lonesome job. When you're used to hundreds of thousands of people around you, when you can get the buzz of, of so many collective energies, then uh, uh, maybe this is a vain uh, sort of, maybe, I don't know.